watching The Bear Pantry Show. My name is Barbara and for over a decade I've been teaching viewers and subscribers how to cook authentic dishes from my home country of Belize and many other delicious dishes from basic ingredients. You're watching The Bear Pantry Show. So let's put us on the screen. Do I need to come more? You good? Okay. All right. And then we have... Hi, Michael. Hi, Edmund. Ed, uh, Michael is in um, Arizona, Edmonds, uh, Nevada, uh, Las Vegas. Christine, Christine, thank you so much for the review. I'm so grateful. I have what eight reviews, right? Eight, eight ratings. Yeah, eight ratings. All right. So I want to introduce Gary. Okay, this is Gary, my uh, website design guy, and now we found out that he's kind of related to Joe. <laughs> I know. I can believe that. <laughs> Hi, Ascari. Happy Easter's. Happy Resurrection Day, everybody. Whatever you believe in. Happy, 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 happy. <laughs> Jasmine is up. Jasmine is, is in Wales. Wow. And she bought one of the books too, and she reviewed one of the books. Wow. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> she reviewed the book. Yeah, I have to introduce Gary. So, Gary is hearing impaired just like Joe. So, sometimes he has to look at me to see what I'm saying. Yes. Okay, guys. So, he's going to look at you, look at me, look at the thingy. <laughs> yes. So, oh my God. Say hi, Joe. Hi, people. <laughs> so Joe found out that his one of his good friend's sister is uh, Gary's grandma. Yes. Right? Gary's grandma is my godmother. So Gary, Gary's yeah. grandma is Joe's godmother. Yeah. Because she's the sister to one of Joe's good friends. Joe, pull that door. You know sign language? Oh, no, not no. the dog in here. No, I, I, I learned like a little in like school where it's like, this is sign. Mm -hmm. um, this is um, deaf. Yeah, yeah. Hearing. Like hard of hearing. And then uh -huh. I think the only thing you need to remember for me is forgot. Forgot. <laughs> forgot. Yeah. The, um, me and Joe used to take sign language before really? Joshua was born. Okay. And then each child took sign language in, I think, college as their second language. So Jada knows it a lot. Jada can oh, help okay. people out. And blah, blah, blah. We kind of forgot a lot of it. Okay. Hi, 27 Ave. You guys, I'm so happy to have Gary here. Where's Carla? Carla didn't go. Oh my God, it's late for you guys. It's already 11 o'clock for oh most of these goodness. people on the East Coast, Gary. We're still making it, though. It's still it's still Easter. <laughs> yeah, um, Christine's on the East Coast. Uh, Ascari's right here in California. I've not met Ascari yet, though, but we'll meet. Uh, Jasmine said, welcome to the family. Oh, my gosh. Thank you. <laughs> thank you. Definitely, I'm, like, really felt a family now. He, Michael says, you sound kind of like Josh. And I, I think you kind of look like a cross between my baby brother and one of my cousins, the one that's the preacher. Yeah. Like, I definitely see some kind of resemblance. Definitely. That's why we're family. <laughs> <laughs> so, guys, my God. Gary, do you want to tell him what we found out about the book? We yes. can just kind of figure oh, it out goodness. by happenstance. You know, okay, so... um. Let me get rid of this one. Let me get rid of Jasmine saying that she's awake. Okay. So you guys know th that the guy is ripping me off of my book, right? So the guy led me to believe, the dead guy led me to believe that he sends my book out to get it made, yeah. get it made like yes. at a third party. And then he sells it to Amazon so that Amazon can sell it to the public. So I'm like happy that he's dead and the business is folding because then nobody will be doing that anymore, hopefully, right? Right, right. That is until we found out what we found out today. And it's just by me, Gary, and Jermaine. Jermaine is outside with Joshua, Jory, and Jada, and Esther, and they're playing some kind of board games right now. But we were just talking, right? And, just and it just the book. hit us. It just hit us. Guess what's happening? Miss Lucky, you're the one that told me to check the back of the book. To see where the book came from right the book that i'm selling now well tell me why when i went to go check the back of the book that the man is selling it has the same information you guys what this man has done is upload my book to kdp yeah he has his own kdp account and when amazon makes the book and it sells cha-ching the money goes into his yeah. account he gets paid 60 days later from amazon he gives me nothing for 12 years yeah. The book is never going to be stopped. Oh, my God. I don't know what to do. Gary Gary was trying to calm me down. Goes, We're going to fix it. Yeah. We're going to fix it. Yeah. We do, hopefully you can because, you know, I know some people um, that might have some information on Amazon that can help us get on the way. And then remember when we, I did, like, that research for you and we saw, like, how much he was selling? Uh-huh. It's crazy. Yeah. Gary was one of them along with, um, what's her name, Kevin's turn mom. She looked it up for me two years ago. She's mm -hmm. the one that called me and told me that she's another Belizean um, um, yes. a young lady. She called and told me 
that the man was making a lot of money. And then you looked it up when, when yeah. I met you. And so even though he's dead and cold, in, well, he's not cold in the grave, he's ashes. He's <laughs> ashes. <laughs> it's not mad. It's not mad. His wife that don't need this money, he, she's still going to get cha-ching yeah. cha -ching from the 1,500 authors. Yeah. I wish we could find some of these authors, right? 1,500 authors, and she's still going to get money from KDP every month from now till the end of time until we figure how to get through the Amazon and tell him he has no authority yeah. to sell my book. You have no authority, Amazon, to make my freaking I know. Oh, my God. I started to feel sick. <laughs> oh, man. I know. I it's... started to itch. Yeah, I could t I could tell earlier. I was like, "Oh man, Barbara must really be," feeling. and I could see it because you know it's a hard thing for it to hit you and just realize that you know after all these years, like even seeing that, like oh, you open the book and it's like you. Open my heart sunk. I was like, "Oh my goodness." My heart sunk. But the Bible say, "All things work together for good for those that are called by God." Yeah. So I have to believe because we are righteous. We are we are um, righteousness um, of Christ in God because we believe in God, right? Yes. And so. Whatever they're doing here, I don't know how it's going to get fixed, but it's going to get fixed to where it's going to push this new book. I have yeah. to believe that. Yeah. Or else I go to bed crying every night. See, Michael said, what no. the F? Well, you know, you know, it's funny. And this is the, well, let me throw something in it for Easter. You know, uh -huh. one of the greatest stories I think that I like in the Bible uh -huh. is a story of, um, and forgive me if I'm misquoting it, but mm -hmm. Jacob, mm -hmm. when he had to work for um, his uh, wife. Uh, was it Rachel or Rebecca? Rachel, right? One of them ugly ones, Leah. Was Le it Leah? Was the first wife. Uh -huh. The first one he got was Leah. Uh -huh. And he worked seven years for her. Uh -huh. And then dad said, oh, you wanted you wanted Rachel or uh -huh. Rebecca, whichever one? Uh -huh. Oh, work another seven years. So yeah. it's been 14 years. Yeah, that man was trifling. The dad was trifling. Trifling. <laughs> Same thing. And that's what I was thinking. I was like, 14 years, that but he finally got what he and needed. And he worked so long for Kakai and Leah. He did not like Kakai and Leah. She was Kakai. What was wrong with her? I didn't she, know. Was she was Kakai. She was Kakai? 27 oh half, 27 half is a guy, right? He says, go and regulate on them blood clots. Oh, my. <laughs> Jamaica in the house. <laughs> he know he up on Turks and Caicos. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Oh yeah, my goodness. but uh, uh, 27 half will, will, you know, we, it will shake somebody for me, okay? Yeah. He's protected. So I, I look cooling. <laughs> Miss Lock, Miss, come Miss Lockie, cool cool so that's why Miss Lockie is from Guyana. Um, it's, but, uh, you notice no Belize yeah. in there, right? If oh, any yeah. Belize in the house, say hello. You notice no Belize in there. Yeah. Yeah. Adway, Arafi, Arafi that believes them. Sorry, Arafi. <laughs> <laughs> I tell you, I start to itch ever since the thing happened. <laughs> it's, it can. It does definitely make you nervous and it's stuff like that. It just weighs on you. And, you know, I think Barbara, it's going to mm -hmm. come true that, you know, you got some good people. Obviously, uh, we connected. You got your man. You got more people coming in your mm -hmm. corner and the more mm -hmm. people that can, like, support and back you. Mm -hmm. And everyone out there that can, like, support and back you, we can get, you know, get this taken care of. I mean, and, I, and I'm so glad with Gary's attitude because Gary said, you know, people might look on it from the outside and say, oh my God, why is it taking you so long, 12 years to get this fixed? But he sees when he came on board three, four years ago and we talked about it and we looked and we kind of left it. Because if I like go into it full force, I'm going to get sick. Yeah. I'm going to get sick and yeah. I don't want to have a stroke over this, right? Yeah. Oh, she don't know. If, oh, Lord, she don't know Belizean. She don't Trini. Trini. I think she married to Belizean though, right? Why say, why say you Belizean? So, see, no is in the house to represent. I Look know. at that. Yeah. It's a damn shame. <laughs> Why? Because we look too good? Is that the problem? The, yeah, the Belizean <laughs> team, tag team. <laughs> yeah, so it's like, I really got, like he said, good people surrounding me. Jermaine, oh my God, Jermaine's visit has been amazing. Jermaine has eaten everything. And let me tell you. Jermaine has is eating so little bit of everything because he's trying to pace himself. <laughs> oh man! But well, speaking of the most amazing Easter Belizean dinner, I sit there and I'm like about to eat Barbara out of house at home because <laughs> I love it. Oh, my I love goodness. it. I love it. I said, Jermaine, see how to eat. You see how to eat. Jermaine's like, I've been here since Wednesday. I'm pacing myself. <laughs> No, oh, so Arafi there. husband is Belizean. I knew there was some oh, connection. Okay, there you go. Where's Sarita? Sarita, are you in this room? I have a, a Belizean friend down there in LA too. Sarita, really cool people, man. Really cool. Okay. So see how they're, you can see them talking there. Yeah. They will just take a look at the lens. It's kind of hard because I'm, you have I'm, to look I'm at the lens, the right? Yeah, right? you have to like make sure you're coordinating, watch the host, watch the mm -hmm. camera lens, it's everything. But I, I think I got it. Uh -huh. Hi, Penny. <laughs> and see, the next thing, uh, some of the people use a username, but they allow me to call them by their regular name, right? right. Their real name. 
And so I have to know their username and their government name. And that's I have to remember both. Yes. Right. But it's easy because Jada hang along with hang around with a lot of drag queens, and I have to know their boy names when they're dressed as boy, mm. and their girl names when they're dressed as girl. Because you don't want to be <laughs> that's, disrespectful, right? That's respectful. Yeah, that's very yeah. respectful. Amazon rejected my first review because I mentioned YouTube. I wrote another one today and they put it up in an oh, so that's okay. you. Oh. So that was her. Remember, I yeah. said maybe it's her. Okay, uh, that's Thank you. You. <laughs> you can't mention, they don't want you to mention no other platform. They're very proprietary <laughs> yeah. about that. Hi, AG. And we're working on the book cover for the, the Belizean book that we want to put up to replace the one Amazon. Amazon is doing the stealing now. Yeah, Amazon, Amazon and him. It's always been Amazon it's and always him. Amazon. Yeah, it's always the, and you know how we figured out too because the other one, the small change diet, the people ex libris took down that first book, the one where I'm on it twice, the fat me and the skinnier me. And I remember I told them I want to end my contract with them, and they said, "Give us thirty days, we're gonna take it down." Well, they took it down. Mm -hmm. It's not even been thirty days. Yeah. Amazon gonna put up the one the man did because he uploaded the files to them too. Yeah. So he has a KDP. If I didn't do a KDP account with my sister, didn't tell you me never KDP, know. I would never know this. I would never know this. Now, for me to get through to Amazon to tell them that another seller, which is Amazon and mm -hmm. this crook, is selling my book, I have to create a seller's account, and they want thirty nine ninety. They don't do no free seller's account no more. It looks like. Yeah. They want the thirty nine ninety nine a month. I'm not doing that. So Gary gonna get me a number. I'm gonna reach out to the BBB tomorrow because they reached out to me Friday and said they can't find the man nowhere because the man dead, right? Yeah. But they're hiding. They don't even have to do it out in the garage. KDP yes. is doing it for them. Yeah, someone's doing something. Someone's and and Jermaine, something. Jermaine bought one of the books, the yeah. the um the cookbook. Yeah. Jermaine bought one, and it's going to arrive uh, Tuesday, and he's going to look in the back and see where it got shipped from because oh, he knows yeah. where his other book got shipped from. And then he then will know definitively that it's KDP. That, but we know it's KDP because they have the barcode and they have the, the thing saying where it was made. Yeah. That's what K, Miss Lucky taught me that because I didn't know that. Yeah. Hi, Nun. Hello. No, sometimes you see people come up like that. Yeah. They could be trolls. They could just want to be incognito. Anyone. You just have to watch. You You're know, so what welcome. Saying. <laughs> yeah, they're welcome till they start to do bullshit. Then they, they get kicked in the teeth. That's true. That's true. Where, where, where the pick then they say you're gonna F around and find out. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, I can get used to this. I have to I have to visit the bear pantry show more. Yeah, um, sometimes when I'm doing a live, I'll send you the link and you can come and talk in the chat there. Okay. Amazon shows beans and rights book publishers author inc. He is the publisher because he gave them the files because yeah. I gave him the files. Right, but it's my name. Like Gary keeps saying, it's your name on the book. Yes, yes. And there's only one Barbara McNabb Greenwich out there that you know that's an author out there. Yes. And Amazon has authority from him because he had gotten authority from me. But I ended that authority back in 2017, and he never stopped because he said I wouldn't even know how to do that. You would just go unpublish the damn book. Yeah. KDP says whenever I want to unpublish a book, I can unpublish a book for whatever reason. They don't. They're not just gonna. They're not gonna put it out there no more. Right. Yeah, so he could have unpublished the book. But why unpublish something that's making you money? Yeah. That's... I'm probably the one that's making him the most money because his other authors don't have a platform like I do. Yeah. And growing it steady, 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 right? Yeah, they're just using your name, I mean, and the fact that it's already out there mm -hmm. to just kind of keep generating whatever they can. And, I mean, unfortunately, that's a bad part with Amazon. I mean, I'm not going to bad my Amazon. I'm just saying. No, you were saying we did a YouTube. <laughs> then look, yeah. <laughs> Well, yeah, we, we're going to find some where good news is I definitely think, you know, it's getting closer. And I mean, like, hopefully it's just really soon that we get our res resolution for it. Yeah. I just would like that piece for you. It's it's kind of nice having a team behind me, though, like with um, uh, Gary and Jermaine and Christine that was digging up stuff and Bella before her that was digging up stuff. And just you guys here to support. It really helps. See, I always get like 18 people in my yeah. life, right? Yeah. Angels. Mm-hmm. 18 people in my life. So now I get up to 30 when we're doing ratchet stuff. We're cussing people out. We get up to 30. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes you have to cuss people out to like get it off your chest though. Yes. But it's like I, that thing really hit me in my heart. I'm like, KDP is producing this book. He's not printing it from his garage like yeah. I thought. Yeah. You know, it took me this long to find out. And if my sister didn't tell me to make a book with KDP, I wouldn't even know the back parts. Like I'm showing you the back parts of yeah. KDP. I just learned it. Mm -hmm. I just learned it. Because Gary's going to do a series of books, too. The books are going to be about Belizean folklore. Oh, yes. my God. I can't wait. You're going to do Tata de Hende? I'm going to share this. Uh, hopefully, the first one um, around my birthday in August. Uh -huh. I really want to get out there. And I mean, I don't want to give too much away. What days in August is your birthday? 
24th. 24th, okay. I'm, 24th. I'm the 14th. You're 10 days after me. Yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. I do remember that. Yeah, uh -huh. so it's we're in the same spectrum, you know. That's a good energy. <laughs> but I know after I purchased it. Yes, you will, Michael. Yes, you will. <laughs> His, they said, okay, Edmund, they're still publishing because every publisher that he got to sign up with him, he went to his KDP account. He uploaded the file just like I did. I yes. saved it as a PDF. Yeah. He he formatted it. He had to do the formatting himself. Yeah. They, they didn't have Canva back then. Yeah. So he had and he he makes software. Yeah. And the software that I I bought the software from him for one hundred ninety nine dollars mm -hmm. to type the book in there. I sent him the files. He did something in his software to make it whatever KDP or yeah. back then it was Create Space. He he made what they wanted. He uploaded it to them. He puts that he's the publisher. Yeah. And KDP just prints, prints, prints on yeah. demand. Yeah. That's and that's the sad part because they don't have any kind of security in between there. Even though they're supposed to, I mean, like I said, if your name is on Amazon, it says it, you click Barbara. Uh-huh. Your author, uh -huh. it goes to you. Yeah, and all those books are lined up on that shelf. And they're shelf. lined up there. So how are they going to say that you have no right to say what you can and can't sell mm -hmm. if it's going directly to you? We just have to be able to get through. And I'm not paying that $39 to just let them call me for this seller's thing because they jerk you around. We're, yeah. we're going to try to go about around it first before we have to come back and yeah. settle on that if we have to settle on that, right? That's why I didn't close it. I just stopped yeah. and I didn't continue. Yeah. Hi, Reed, come you go a long time to see. Be, you're asking a question about Belize folklore. Yeah, we have a lot of okay. Anansi story. Okay, well, it's <laughs> well. The, this one is actually, um, you know, everyone knows the name Tata Duhende. Mm -hmm. It's a scary one. Uh -huh. I'm gonna do something on that, um, and I don't want to give away too much because, again, they're trying to keep intellectual property, you know, mm -hmm. under wraps. But I could just tell you this: it's gonna be a series. It's gonna have both um, illustrations that I draw myself, mm -hmm. along with the stories um it's going to go really really um heavy on the like not necessarily fantasy side but a lot of this is real stories i've mm -hmm. actually the first story is a true story mm -hmm. and people don't know this but this actually happened to me in belize with me my brother and my cousin we we're out in the woods right and i swear barbara we're playing in the woods and we hear something someone looks back like what is that and we couldn't tell what it was. We all jump on this bike. Um, I'm, we're all little at the time. My mm -hmm. cousin's a little older, a teen, riding us, riding us, riding us back home. I get there at home that night. I'm sleeping in my bed, sleeping in my bed. And I wake up and I look out my window. And I remember this vividly because I remember everything about Belize. I look through my window and there's just something out there in the field because it's a stilt house. You know, the uh -huh. stilt house in Belize, you look down. Something is just there like glowing in the yard. And I, I took my cover. I went back to sleep. It was scary. But obviously, I mean, some of it's fiction. It's a kid's imagination. It's not, I'm not saying it's true, but there's a well, lot of well, things. Well, even if it's not true, those those stories are, you know, they're, yeah. they, they have you by the, the edge yeah. of your seat. And you could you could use that same Canva, mm -hmm. draw your thing, and upload your picture into it. Oh, uh, Because you don't have to worry about formatting and then write your story on that side or whatever. And they have the videos where the guys show you, like when they do the coloring book, mm -hmm. how they do the page two times, move the left to the right, move the right to the left. And so it flows through the staple or whatever, the, the binding. Yeah. So, uh, so. Oh, can I plug? Let me, if you want yeah, to see the teaser. So uh -huh. the teaser, if any of you are watching and you want to see the teaser comic book that I draw for this, you could go to my website. Uh -huh. It's www. Oh, I could type? Yeah, type oh, it so in. Let me type. All right, so www.graphics.com. So if you go there to my website, um, mm -hmm. I have a, just scroll down a little bit. I think that's the wrong. Oops, graphics. graphics. Uh -huh. <laughs> you might, I might need you to. Gary. Garifuna. You Wait, where's my eye? eye? You got Garifuna? Did that. you tell me that before? I have. Graphics. Wait, graphics. Uh -huh. Yeah. Graphics. Oh, you know what? Com. It doesn't need the dot com. It's there's no dot com. It's actually the funny thing is uh -huh. instead of a dot com, I have a dot graphics, which is crazy. Oh, okay. So it's Garifuna dot graphics. Dot graphics. So are you Garifuna? Yes. No, like uh -huh. actually not like true Garifuna. Uh -huh. That's just a name that was like nickname for me because Gary Garifuna. Oh, okay. I thought but you. But my mom, from... I, I know they have to be from all those people in Davis Bank. Someone in there has to be Garifuna. <laughs> <laughs> Someone has to be. <laughs> Garifuna is a different culture of Belizeans. Yes. Because we're Creoles, and then Garifuna is a different culture. Yes. But they have a whole different language, 
whole different type of food. Yeah. They have their own flag, everything. Yeah, yeah. You know I just, I try to get into it more and learn about it. Because for me, it's like, I think everything about Belize culture, mm -hmm. I want to be a part of, you know, no matter mm -hmm. from the Mayan side to it, to you got the Creole, but certain, certain parts, certain cultures don't let you in. They don't. The Garifuna culture don't they like don't. to let you in. They let my dad in because he was born and raised in PG and Stan Creek or whatever. But they don't let us in. But I forced my way in. So yeah. I, I know some of their little catchphrase and he cuss out words. I know. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's true. It's true. There's definitely some There's definitely some friction. But, you know. <clears throat> Michael wants to know if you have a YouTube channel. Oh, I do not. I'm sorry. I don't have a YouTube Welcome channel. Welcome to your other website where you were teaching people how to talk Creole. I did. I had my Creole language guide up there, and uh -huh. um, that website went under. Um, I'm going to post it back up on um, Girlfriend Graphics, so okay. I'll put that again. Oh, you love the One Drop shirt? Thank you so much. I'm so glad you love those. So I, I didn't share those with you. So uh -huh. I created these shirts that they're like a little drop. I'm uh -huh. sorry, it's like a teardrop. And it just says one um, one drop, okay. 7,000 years of culture, because the Caribbean and all the people in the Caribbean, it's we've been there for 7,000 years plus. Mm -hmm. um, so I'll share that with you after this. All I'll right, show you. all right. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah usually, usually Black Americans don't like to hear about one drop. Yeah. Because they figure it has to do with slavery. Well, yeah. And I mean, mm -hmm. I say that too. It does in a sense because, you know, they say, oh, one drop of your blood means this. Well, for me, one drop of this means history. Mm -hmm. One drop is that. I take mm -hmm. it back. And did forward. you do your ancestry DNA? I'm going to. I, You know, um, me and Joe did ours and I found out we're related, right? Yeah, I saw the reveal. Yeah, I watched your reveal. <laughs> I saw the reveal. That was so cool. I think it's, we're tracing it to my dad's mother's like parents one of the parents the dad or the mom and then joe's dad mother's people somewhere okay. up there somewhere several generations somebody was related oh really I don't know if it's by marriage or what the hell is going on well you mm -hmm. know, we, we already married i have three kids and none of them have any problems so we're good <laughs> <laughs> i know huh i know how huh? you know your they're looking beautiful. see they're gonna check out your site already sees miss lucky said i like oh, the comic strip thank you thank you so much again these are all just in the making you know i i can't wait to really get them more exact but thank you so much mm -hmm. i love the feedback thank you me and gary well gary was marveling at all the things that joe has created and you guys saw right the chair oh, the, the table blah, blah, blah. the kitchen he didn't even know about the kitchen right and so he goes that's why you guys you know mesh so good because you're both creators but gary is creative too because every time I come with an idea, you know how to run with it. And then it gives you an idea for something else you yeah. want to do, right? Yeah. yeah, so he's creative too. That's why we, we, we That's match. That's why I think we're related. <laughs> Should put up examples of your art. Yeah, he's going to make them into yes. books. Yes. Right? Gonna make yes. Them into I'm, books? Def I'm definitely going to put it. I actually have some artwork as well, too, that was on my own site. I just took a lot of stuff down. This new site is, um again, it's still kind of new. Just kind of um, starting a new job recently and getting back in the swing of things. So more to come for sure. And a thank you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, see? Love all the Caribbean going for mine. Bitcoin. Oh, yes. Uh, the, the So the Bitcoin comic. So I did this comic strip where I have a bunch of like the Caribbean people. Uh -huh. And they show up to this office where it's a Bitcoin agency. And it says, we're here for the Bitcoin mining jobs. But mm -hmm. they're all carrying axe and pick and wagon <laughs> and a canary. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So, yeah, I have oh the little Caribbean God. comic strips I'm doing as well, too. So, yep, lots of stuff. And over here, I have some of the some of my You can't see it because it's not on YouTube. It's on StreamYard. But, like, Miss Loki is a moderator at my site. So, she has a wrench attached to her at YouTube. So, she has... She can post links and stuff like that. Okay. So, like, if nice. you didn't want to type it just now, she could type it in for us and not get blocked for spam by YouTube because uh, they're moderators. 27 Ave is a moderator, but he's also a member at my at my site. I love the black and white noir right. vibe of the Tata Duende preview. Oh, thank Tata you Tata so Duende much. scares me to... It and does, it You know does. my friend found on them that do the movie? Uh -huh. They were going to do a movie about it, then the pandemic hit. So do your book first, and then you have to do licensing, right? <laughs> that's what I'm hoping. I'm like, I really want to, I want the book, because that's how all these Marvel stuff and all these get started. They start with this book, and someone says, I'm going to do a movie on it. Uh -huh. But I was actually thinking, too, like, why couldn't I do it? Like, later on, do my own little short movie. Oh, I want to talk with you about Sonia Amazon, too. This person said, hello, love your show. My boyfriend is half Belizean, mother Miss Gillette from PG. When it was British Honduras, he loves the food. I cook for him. I got I got from your show. His family I know some, is in I know someone by the last name of that. Jillet? Yeah. Then Jillet and then Tillet, they are related. I, then a royal breed. 
a Caribbean joke book would be nice. Uh-huh. That is a good one, too. Uh-huh. That would be a good one. Yeah, you guys throw the ideas out here. Gary, soaking it up, man. Yes, these are some great ones. And then Michael said, it's cool. Yes. Uh, all right, Michael, thank you. <laughs> I appreciate that. Mm-hmm. Wow. Oh my goodness. But yeah, you know, I want to say, go back to what you said with Joe, everything he made. I was just so amazed. And then he's, he's showing me these songs he sings too. And then I'm like, you guys are just, he's, you guys are says, just he says, relationship let me goals. Go, he says, let me go make a, um, a logo for Joe. I gotta go make a logo for Joe. I'm like, <laughs> yes. you know, he's country as hell, Gary. Look, wait, 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 wait. Gary and Joe come from the same hometown. Sand Hill. Sand We're both Hill. from Sand Hill. How you like them apples? <laughs> <laughs> Seriously. Seriously. And that's why maybe I love his music. I was like, I mean, he was playing the songs. I was like, you got, you know, he's got mm-hmm. the nice little um, chords and vibration to it. I'm like, and he can sing? Mm-hmm. And you can you sing. know Jenna sing, right? Yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah. Yeah. Tracy, welcome. Welcome to the family, Tracy. I'm meeting people that I've been speaking to. Like, uh, Jermaine was five years and Gary is about... Right before the pandemic, yeah. right? About three years? Yeah, right, 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 yeah, 2020, right, right there. When I redid the Beans and Rice Volume 2 book, and then I sold it first through Cash App, and then I told you, go ahead and build a website. Yeah. So Gary's the one that takes care of my website. He's the one that's flagging that other crooked-ass website, <laughs> the Bear Pantry. People yeah. call me. Every, you know what? Did I tell you that Amazon gave them my number? It's Amazon that gave them your number? Yes, when the, the old white man called and said he ordered some candy bar, and he didn't get his candy bar, so he called, because uh, he called Amazon first to buy the candy bar. They didn't have it. Mm-hmm. So they told him to go to, they, they Googled, the representative Google. They, they're doing the most because the man all and white, yeah. right? And they Googled and said, oh, go to the Bear Pantry. He ordered it, took two weeks. It didn't come. Then after that, he said some candy bars showed up. So he wanted to buy more. So when he went to go buy more, they said they couldn't process his payment. So he called back Amazon, not the Bear Pantry, but Amazon, and tell him, where this place where you send me at where the stuff take too long to come, and then they don't want to process my payment now for more. Yeah. And Amazon sold the candy for $28 a box. This place sent it for $58 a box. So I told him maybe they buy it from Amazon and sell it to him. He said, no, Amazon hasn't had it in five months. So when he called back to complain, the representative of Amazon Googled yeah. the Bear Pantry and found my number on Google. Then they look at the show part. Give the man my number and the That's man called me. Amazon trifling. They They're trying me. Big time. Big time for that. I can't believe that. Hi, Myrna. When Myrna. Okay, Myrna came in. This MNF is Myrna. She believes in too. She believes in. Sun Hill. Sun Hill Boy. Joe, Joe YouTube channel used to be called Sun Hill Boy, but we changed it to um Hello People Joe here. Oh, yeah? Hello People Joe here. Because he likes to say that. Okay. So we changed it from Sun Hill. People can't spell boy like that <laughs> but that was joe youtube channel sun hill boy sun hill so if boy. you look if you go to youtube and you type it in my still come up in the um in the you know, it'll come up, up here up okay. there in the um search bar it'll come up as that but then his title now is hello people joe here what happened to easter babes you say happy easter yeah i like i like the story that gary tell about <laughs> trifling <laughs> ass <laughs> was um, working so hard for Leah and Iwa Rachel and it worked seven more for Rachel. I know. <laughs> and then Rachel was the one that had um, Joseph and Benjamin and that's why he loved those children more mm-hmm. and all the other one that he had from all the other sisters and so on that he got in between. Yeah. He didn't care too much for them. And so then when they sold Joseph into slave, remember? Yeah. Those yeah. brothers because the dad loved Joseph more he come from Rachel. Yes, mm-hmm. yeah, that's mm-hmm. what I remember. Yeah, that I remember. Yeah, um, Benjamin, the youngest one, Joseph, then Benjamin. Yeah, yeah, mm-hmm. yeah. See, we know our little Bible stories. You get your Easter um, education here as well. <laughs> <laughs> that's cool oh that you goodness. remember because most people, I couldn't, I wouldn't be able to tell most people about like you know, even that story, and uh-huh. they would be able to even follow because you know, yeah. they'd be like, oh, yeah, I kind of remember it. I, I read I read the Bible from front to back every year and it takes me a year. Same here. Okay, well, no, I haven't done it in a few years. Uh-huh. But there was a point in time that I did it and I said, you know what? I'm going to read this from the very beginning to the very end. Mm-hmm. And I did it three times. Uh-huh. And then, you know, it was just like I tried to keep going, keep going. Yeah, obviously it fell off. But yeah, that's I crazy. Did, I started doing it in 06. Mm-hmm. And then I would do it from front to back like that. Then sometimes I'll start from the... the um the the gospels yeah and go to the end and then go back from the front to the gospel yeah yeah that's what i would do sometimes because i hate leviticus 
Oh, the begots my and the begots and the begots. And this begot this, oh. that begot this. Oh, my favorite oh, book my in the Bible is Philemon. And numbers. Yeah. Numbers. But you know how you know people do astrology and they do numbers? Mm -hmm. I like numerology and I tell them God loves numbers too because he loves it so much. You name a whole book numbers. Right, right. Mm -hmm. That's true. And you know, it's funny because I think like I like you know they have you have like your life number and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. It's funny because like I always have like my my like IG is like Garifuna Seven, uh -huh. and then like I never knew this. Like you look up like the whole astrology thing. Not saying you believe in astrology, but mm -hmm. my life number in astrology is seven, and I never knew that. And See? I always just would put seven out for everything. Uh huh. That's crazy. My, my number is eight. eight. Me and you are both eights. Really? In in See? numerology, and eights are sent to handle money. Oh my goodness. Well, add yours up when you're done. See, he said, Gary should do a story time episode on this channel or on Bear Pantry Talk. <laughs> yeah, when, what, what about when the books come out? Uh, then when, come back August, and promote yeah, the book. Yeah. When the books come out, you come back to promote it. Yeah. And then we could tease it. You know what I mean? Don't give everything because they have to buy the book. I'll share cover. You know what? Because I'm going to do covers first. <laughs> mm -hmm. So um, when I do the cover, I will share the cover. I'll um, talk to Barbara and mm -hmm. see if I could come on, share the cover. You guys could see the cover artwork first mm -hmm. um, and then definitely get it. Edmund said the language of God is mathematics. Yes. I believe that. I, I believe, believe that. It. I believe it. I mean, I'm scared every time someone gives me a receipt and it says 666, I say, add this onto my bill. <laughs> You're like my sister. You pay for 666? Every, no, every time I see it, I uh -huh. say, no, charge me something else. Oh my God. You like my sister. I mean, I'm not afraid for 666. 666 out of the 18, and I'm not afraid for 18 because there's always 18 people in my room. Oh, okay, okay. The, um, Nun, do we know you, Nun? We wanted to welcome you. But Nun said, I only wanted to wish everybody a happy Easter. Maybe it's somebody working on a different name. Gary afraid for 666. My sister afraid for that. It's But it, you know, the funny thing is, nothing bad ever happens when I see it. Mm -hmm. It's just, I'm, I put it in my head for some reason, but it always pops up. So maybe it might be, it could be something more of a sign type number that I see. You never know. But every time it pops up, I just get scared. Like, oh my goodness. The, um, when I had my first logo, I'll show you afterwards the way the lady built it and looped some of the letters. Yeah. People told me I was devil because it had 666 in it. <laughs> oh my goodness. I didn't even see it till somebody showed me. I'm like, okay. Oh my goodness. So Miss Lucky is promoting my Patreon yeah. and all my stuff. All right. I'm Penny live right up here in San Diego. I met Penny already. Penny's the one that gave me the floor for the kitchen. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. okay. She had the wood, the, the stick together wood, the, 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 the um snaps together. Yeah. And we put that in before. Before we did the kitchen, we put in the floor. Okay. Okay. Yeah. No, so I, nice. I got some good people behind me, man, because you guys, we sold 24 books in one week. And we got eight five star um what do you call it again when it's not a review? Um rating. 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 Eight five star rating. Seven people left reviews, and one person just left me five star without a review. Hey, whoever you are, thank you. You guys try to review and don't say nothing about knowing me from YouTube. Don't even like try to tell them that you know me at all. You're just a random stranger buying the book and you love the book for whatever reason and give me five stars. Because me and Jermaine looked at another book that came out the ending of March mm -hmm. and the book was number two out of the out of the top ten. And we're like, how is this book number two? We have six reviews and five of the six reviews were trashing the book. Me and Jermaine ready to go there, going in on this book. So we screenshotted one of the trashing, and we're going to give one of the viewers that to write, but the opposite of it. Right. Whatever they said was wrong with the book is what's right about my book. Right. So we're going to rewrite it, give them what to say. And when we look who make the book is America's Test Kitchen. And everybody said, we always buy their book. We look forward to it. They probably did pre-orders. But this book is bullshit, and they trash it. They said they show the bread. The bread looked like concrete cement, oh broke up in pieces. I said, "Oh my god, oh why?" My <laughs> oh my goodness. Uh, Edmund said, "Las Vegas, most hotels don't have a 13th floor, but the sixth floor, floor is okay." okay. Yeah, yeah, the 13. They get rid of the that people are very afraid of 13 too. I guess I'm not superstitious like that. The numbers don't scare me. Yeah, yeah, I, I, I kind of got it. Well, let's, let's say I found a man's T-shirt I want to purchase next month. Your eyes with color combinations. All right. Well, I um, reach out to me side? for that one. Okay. That's what I'm wondering. Yeah, reach out to me for that one, Michael. Um, I will definitely um, be in contact. Mm -hmm. um, and you know what? You know what I need to do? We need to do some bare pantry shirts. Mm -hmm. We need to do some bare pantry. You don't have apparel. the cartoon, right? Yeah. And then I, I wanted to, um, I think Joshua already rubbed out that off the leaf. I like that. I didn't even think about that. Just having a little roller pin. 
Well, that or was my, that was my logo before, but I changed it to the dragonfly because yeah. I like dragons. Because I don't want to be stuck with just cooking. I want to be like Pioneer Woman, branch out into other things too. Okay. Yeah. So I have this whole thing, and Joshua already put the dragonfly in here with the um the apprentice show, like like what's on the book. Yeah. Remember I tell you that guy did three cartoons for me, and he didn't color two of them because I have to pay him. Oh. Remember you said send them to you. You'll see if you could color them. I'll send them to you. Yeah, yeah, you see. yeah, definitely. Yeah, then, but he did three cartoons like this. He colored this one though. Yeah, we could. We need to get some merchandise out there to get this branded my name number is 13 i'm um, myrna okay i like 13 i think 13 is um good when you're especially in vegas miss lucky says she saw that review and some lady said they did not test the book out they probably got the book from somebody from fiverr put it together for them mm -hmm. and they did not test the recipes and they just thought to sell it because they are america's test kitchen mm -hmm. so they get away with this yeah i heard that martha stewart with her first book years ago she didn't test the recipes and they just put it together for her and people screwed her over by putting in there that you could boil like a pong of spaghetti with a cup of water. Mm -hmm. And you know that's not possible, right? Right. And that book was trifling and trash. She had to pull that off the market. And from there, she controlled everything that goes on under her name. Oh, okay. She don't play no more. Yes, yes, Miss Lucky working hard. I'm sorry, Carla. I miss this man. Carla probably just in the bed, not even get the alert. And I don't have my phone in here, so I can't text her and tell her. <laughs> Carla, come in, come meet handsome Gary. Carla! <laughs> Carla is um Trini and Guyanese mix. Okay, okay. See, this is my my family. It's white Americans, a couple black Americans, and all the other Caribbeans. <laughs> Martha Stewart's recipes still don't. Yeah, they still true. don't come out. That the only true. one she does with Snoop. I've tried them. I've tried them, and I'm like, yeah, except that They're, she's just baking. I mean, she's she's baking herself, not anything else. I hate you know I, mean. I hate when they talk like Martha Stewart was the original because B Smith. The black lady that died from dementia, uh -huh. she was the original. And she 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 had everything going, and then Martha Stewart pick up on that and start to do it. Mm. She's not original. B. Smith was the original. Sounds and, right. And B. Smith was like, she had my name. Her name was Barbara. That's what the B stood for. <laughs> Yay. Miss Lucky said, Gary's eye candy for the show today, man. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> We're gonna make taffy next week on Tableta. <laughs> <laughs> Gary's gonna come back all the time. When Gary sat down and ate. I said, Gary, you could go back for more, you know. I said, because we are pacing ourselves on Jermaine. Because Jermaine, how Jermaine going to start a diet right when he won't come here? No, he started back in February. <laughs> He's really trying to lose weight, though. And so I'm like, go back, Gary. Say, I'm going back. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my gosh. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Look what Edmund said. Edmund said, let me click on it. What a damn thing that it work. Oh, my mouse died. Okay, I thought my mouse died. No, that's Miss Lucky. And months say Martha Stewart had a microwave turkey recipe that had the wings wrapped in tin foil. Oh my god. So I know she didn't test it. It's in the microwave and the wings are wrapped in tin foil. Oh my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that sounds that sounds like <laughs> Martha Stewart original. I don't even like her wine. The wine that they came out with. Uh-huh. It's not even good. Yeah, she just um went over the top after she got into prison. They know, and these, these people know how to parlay prison into money. Yeah. yeah we I'm over just... here trying to do honest things, make honest money, report it, the stuff in our taxes, right? Yeah. I still can't get nowhere, but that's going to change, though. This same book where I write right now is the first one. And we just, like Gary said, so just keep pumping out these books because if you can make money from that book, yeah. that book, that book, that book, you know, for people to have different books to buy, it's just the time now that I have to sit down and get it done. Yeah, you know? just, yeah just buckle down and put into it because, I mean, once one starts rolling in, you mm -hmm. know, it's just like a snowball. It's going to happen more and more and more. And on the Belizean cookbook that we're going to redo to try to bump the other one, the Amazon stealing along with the dead man, we're going <laughs> to do a pop out to where I'm on the picture and the food is popping out at you. Yeah. We were farting around with it. Me and Jermaine started last night, yeah. but Gary came and moved it along pretty fast. So we're going to do a pop out. It's like... <laughs> Here's the plate of food. <laughs> it's gonna look good. I, I like I like the way it's coming out. It's For real, Miss really Lucky. Nice. Snoop helper get some flavor. What stupid help you get Yeah, well, flavor. they're partners on that show, Myrna. They're partners on that show. Now you know Martha Stewart probably want nothing to do with Snoop Dogg, but you know, she needed some like, yeah. black culture in the thing. She was what they call it, um, appropriating or whatever. <laughs> Cult, culture vulture. She's a culture vulture. She, yeah, she's you know. It's I like the fact that she's at least you know at least she's fun to you know do things and stuff like that. But it's you know it's mm -hmm. sad that you know some people just kind of like take take culture and then use it to promote mm -hmm. and elevate themselves. But it is what it is. Mm -hmm. 
and when Gary came, he saw my um, hundred thousand yes. buttons. Can he says, "Can I that? take a picture? I'm gonna go put it at the website. I will put it everywhere because you know what? You're the only Belizean that did it. I, you know what? I think I kind of knew that because 27 of them probably told me you're the only one. But I am the only one. You're the only one. You're the only Belizean. Only Belizean that do that. Only one. First and only. Mm -hmm. And you know, for me, I this funny thing is like this. I remember when the first Belizean I ever saw do something famous was Marion Jones. And then they take stuff from her. Then they had the rapper Shine. Mm -hmm. Then he goes to jail. Then they had this guy that no one really remember named Houston. He was like an R&B singer. Mm -hmm. He had an album. And then the guy stabbed himself in the eye. I'm like, we don't get no break. Oh, my God. <laughs> We're going to do it, Gary. We're going to do it together. We're going to be a team. We're going to be a team. <laughs> yes. Yes. <laughs> 27 Abse, <laughs> if she had some gin and juice <laughs> <laughs> to her recipes, they might improve. Sometimes I go to one of my backstreet channels that's not monetized and we'll play Millie Jackson. And 27 Abu come in and say it's a brown liquor kind of night over there. <laughs> <laughs> Martha's a Leo like us. That um, goes to figure. You feed the dog? You feed the dog? Yeah, yeah, the pick me, the what pick me? Uh-huh. Tell him pack some food. Tell him pack some food. Why do they always come here with the too long hand and bring nothing to care food and they take my stuff? That's how people get stuff. They take your stuff home. Next time you couldn't bring a pataki. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> she said Barbara's a Leo like me. That goes to figure. Yeah. Goes to figure. Still, mm -hmm. Leo's Leo's are uh, good. Are you a Leo like, still? You're not a Leo, right? No, you're a Virgo? Right on the court, right on the borderline. Too, uh, Virgo. Right on the borderline okay. of Virgo. And I think that's why I got like the Leo tendencies with the Virgo tendencies. <laughs> Edmund said Edmund is our encyclopedia, okay? Mm -hmm. He says, I understand Martha is good at making doilies in prison. <laughs> I would make doilies too if I was there, because I know I make no license plate. <laughs> What 20, 27 Ave? He always got something funny to I say. I like man. 27 Avenue. 27 Avenue, I really like your responses. 20, You're really engaging. 20, I think that's 27 great. Ave, do you want to come up on stage? Say yes or no. And I'll <laughs> drop the link for you and you alone. Hi, Cousin Jay. This is a cousin that I met through doing Ancestry. And um, uh, we're not saying her real name. So I call her Cousin Jay, but that's her fake okay. name, Yubi. Across the street. Oh, is this right? There? She lived. No, she lived at San Pedro. Oh, really? No, not San Pedro. I'm sorry. Um, Kikaka, Kikaka. Oh, okay. She said there's some loud music played, so she didn't get the notification. <laughs> Martha Stewart says she sell her mom. Just she to probably be on would TV. too. That's funny. All right, thank you, Myrna. Myrna said, look like Leo bounced back for everything, so maybe I'll bounce back. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. No, somebody told me. Um. So I forget who already that told me. They said. We're so glad to see that you did the book because anybody else that got ripped off like that would have quit. Mm. They wouldn't have, you know, continued and make book and make book and make book. You see how yeah. I try, right? Yeah. yeah. I finally feel like I'm at the right spot because when I make those books in Canva as a PDF, they're mine. You see how it's saved there? It's yeah. mine. Yeah. And I could go change it anytime I want and, pro and produce it. Now, at um, Amazon, I allow them to do extended or expanded um, um, distribution. So Barnes & Noble picked up the book. So they're trying to sell it. So if they sell it, I want to get three forty-one off of each book from them. Okay. Okay. Yeah. So, but they they um, they posted on Google and they go pick up this book from the, um, uh, Barbara McNabb Village. Blah 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 blah. Okay. Leo's a fighter, huh, Tracy Gal? Leo's a fighter. <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh, the crowd there for Easter. Yeah. Um, all kind of people probably up there on the island for, for um, Easter yeah. right now. Well, the crowd is here: Jory, Esther, um, um, Jermaine, Jada, Josh. They didn't bring Mabel. Open the new phone. Oh, you get it? Sorry. Esther! <laughs> Esther! Oh, sorry, Bob. I knew you were recording. No, we're not recording with the stream. Tell Esther to say hi. Esther. Esther, come say hi. I say, more you guys join, remember on the bring on our own stuff to take on our own food home. We did. I did I you did? Yeah, we did. Come, come. And I brought your thing back. Let me get from the bar. Come, come, sir. Come say hi. Let him go get the food. <laughs> He's trying to run. <laughs> <laughs> He's trying to run. Don't be shy. Right oh, okay. That's the camera right there. <laughs> say hi. hi. And she didn't bring my granddaughter today. <laughs> She's sick. <laughs> We're sending her food. We're sending, we made her cake special. <laughs> so we're just talking to the people about all the stuff we found out about my book. Oh, okay. You saw my new cookbook, like right? Book, yeah. You saw the new one? Yeah, I like it. Oh, it's big? I like it a lot. I like it a lot. And everything. Like you guys, pop whatever you want to take, okay? Okay. The chicken, the, if you like the oxtail, that's yeah. in the pot on the stove, get the rice. 
Mm -hmm. Pop whatever you want to take. Don't okay. be shy. And the, and the salad's <laughs> in the fridge. And Thank if you, you see that's only a little bit of salad left, I have another bin somewhere. So don't worry. Just take I what have you want to take. Bin. Yeah. Okay. Just Thank take what you, you want to so take. Much. And then holler for me before you leave so I can tell you bye. I right. will. <laughs> you want the dark one? Just pull it, but don't lock it because the dog going to come back in. <laughs> Just, that's good. That's good right there. Yes. Oh, man. Up to th well, you're up to 30. You add up to 30 on the um, Read coming. Hi. Um, yeah. Come in. Come in. Come in. I have yeah. a pub. I have a publisher, a kid's book. Okay, we come. We go publish a kid. Here, come, let me gonna come sit. Come sit. Yeah, let me get. Let me. Let me. Let me. Just don't sing along. No, sit. Sit for a second. You and sure? Say hi. Yeah. Okay. Sit. 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 <laughs> because I promised them you were gonna come back. You gotta sit. sit. You have to sit. No, sit. I'll be right here. I'm sure. Oh, Barbara's short. giving us all the love on the no, show. I'm right here. See, I'll see them. I'm sure. Hey guys. Hey Carla. Hey Miss Lucky. All my friends. <laughs> he's always in the chat with them. Yes. So no, he's here with us. <laughs> is this so cool? This is like the best Easter because I got it to is. I got to meet two good people, man. <laughs> two good people that's been there for me. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Jermaine is like a permanent sponsor to the show. <laughs> <laughs> Had an amazing week, you guys. It's been so much fun. Yes, and he loved the oxtail. <laughs> yes, really good. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah mm -hmm. it, was, it was amazing. Yeah. We have twenty nine viewers. Mm -hmm. About twenty bushwashers and nine viewers. You think? <laughs> um, yeah, most people probably sleeping talking. from their Easter dinner right now. Yeah, still, you'd have way more if they weren't sleeping already from Easter. Yeah, they're on the East Coast. Though remember, they're three hours ahead of us. Yeah, but some of them will wake up and oh, come yeah. in, right? Mm -hmm. See, Miss Lucky is in New York. Hey, Michael. Oh, Carla made it in. Oh my God, Carla, you would have missed handsome Gary over here. <laughs> Gary, come on in the picture. Gary, come on in the picture. He's only, she only seen half your pretty face. Oh, sorry, sorry. <laughs> yeah, sorry. And we were talking about you two, Carla. I said, Carla, you yeah. missed out. You yes. missed out. We got two handsome men over here. Yes. Hey. Yes. And we took Jermaine to the beach yesterday. So, you know, I'm happy because I went to the beach. Oh, yeah. Which one? Santa nice. Monica. Santa Monica. Okay. That's one I like to go. Wait, Santa Monica? Uh -huh. I was in Santa Monica yesterday. Really? Oh, late. Like no, we, we went early, eight. right? It was early. Yeah, because yeah, we, we came back home at eight at, at uh, Norm's. Yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah, we just walked the pier so he could see the different spots Jada used to sing at. Mm -hmm. and we walked the bike path so he could see that spot. Then we went on the sand, you know, just to be near the ocean. And then we just came back. It was like what hour and a half, right? I think so. Yeah. Yeah, we had a good time. It was, it was nice. pretty busy. It was pretty busy for yeah. a cool day because it was mm -hmm. kind of cold out. It but... was like 63. Yeah. yeah. But we yeah. wore our hoodie, but by the time we did all that walking, we got hot. Yeah, Carla, I'm glad uh, Carla is in Jersey. I'm glad she made it in. Oh. <clears throat> I don't know if it's, all I'm seeing is teeth <laughs> from both of them. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. Uh, uh, Myrna said uh, she got a handsome man by she too, but she husband named hey, Henrik, 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 H okay. H E N R Y K, Henrik. Okay, Henrik. Uh -huh. I was calling him all kind of stuff, Henrik, <laughs> Henrik. <laughs> hey, Ascari, that's my friend. Yeah, Ascari's <laughs> right here in California. Yeah, he's pretty cool. So Sarita's missing out. Sar Sarita is one of my um my. Uh, um, but she's a friend now because she's she's Belize and live in LA. Mm -hmm. She's the one that took me to that Belize restaurant. Oh, okay. Uh, but I don't know where she at. She didn't get the notification. He said, "Call get drinks." <laughs> <laughs> Man, we've been having a blast oh. since Jermaine arrived Wednesday. Yes. Jermaine, when you leave, today. I think I'll sleep for two days. <laughs> no, right? No, right. <laughs> you might be sleeping on the plane going back home. <laughs> oh, Jermaine, Jermaine made bread and he posed with the bread to put in the book. Yeah. And we made good. the we made the most difficult bread yep. out of all the bread. So when you go back now, he knows exactly what to do and what not to do. Yeah. For, and the easier breads, you're gonna find them real easy. And that one wasn't bad. Like Barbara makes it so simple. It's really good. Yeah. Yeah. It yeah. looked good. It looked good. And I was like, wow, he did did a really good job. Yeah. Yes. See, these are my hello, Kian. What it go on? Marvelous Wolf is Kian. He loves Jada. He don't care for we. He wants Jada. <laughs> <laughs> Marvelous Wolf 613. Hey. And for the people coming in late, I need it. You'll never um you'll never figure out what we found out or something like that. You'll never believe what we found out. Is we found out that KDP is actually the one making my books and not a third party. And so Amazon is the one that we have to like pretty much go after also mm -hmm. tell them to stop making those books. But I'm gonna call the BBB tomorrow from Massachusetts and they're gonna let me know what they told me in the email, which they can't find the man because the man dead, right? And I'm going to tell them what I found out 
And then they're going to tell me to go to the attorney general of Massachusetts to go after that company because they need to stop sending my books to Amazon for sale. They, they can unpublish it from KDP just like I can unpublish my own book from KDP. Mm -hmm. I can't do it because it's their account. Yeah. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Yeah. He says, I do love Jada. See? <laughs> See? We didn't even mince words. And then Cousin Jay, she only loved Joe. Everybody get their love. <laughs> Cousin Jay, I know you love me too. But I'm saying Joe's her favorite. She said, I like when Joe come on and say, hello, people. Joe here. <laughs> we didn't even feed the dogs. We're horrible people, Jermaine. What are the dogs going to do when Jermaine leaves? I don't know. They love him. Yes. They love Gary too, but they're like all over Jermaine, especially Cora. Yes. Cora doesn't get no love, so she's all over Jermaine. Yeah. Mm -hmm. They're both sweet. Oh, wow. And all of them saying hi to each other. See, we're like a little family here. We want to do like a meet and greet one of these days where we drive to like a central location and everybody could meet up. Mm -hmm. or yeah. me, me and Joe used, to talk, cool. me and Joe used to talk about taking road trip before the pandemic mm -hmm. and just go to the different states and meet everybody, right? Yeah. But then when I sit on and think about drive, you see how Joe drive, right? <laughs> no, he knows how to drive. He knows yeah. how to drive real well. Yeah. But sometimes he's on two tires. Oh. Two on the left. When you see when he cut in front of him, people. Oh, I'm gonna have to use that because one. Because we when we came home, you said it was two accidents on the road, right? Mm -hmm. The second accident was the circus. The whole circus blew up. Yep. <laughs> the circus truck was on fire. On the, the trailer. The, my mom said that all the time that the two left or the two right. And that's what he do to go in between the cars, <laughs> him and Jada. And then my mom said, they drive like this. They take the little finger and turn the steering wheel. <laughs> I'm telling you, me and Jermaine were just like, <gasps> we held on for their life. And Joe said, if you don't do this, Jermaine, you're not going to um, get home. These people don't want to get out your way. <laughs> yeah. They definitely drive different here. So I was happy that Joe <laughs> and Jada Can you see me driving drive. with Joe across country and them um, redneck territory where them MAGA people will pull him over because he black. Oh, no. Oh, yeah. oh yeah. no. We got pulled over in Utah. Because he didn't get out the lane when the cops pulled over somebody on the shoulder. Mm. We don't have to get out the lane in California. Yeah, in Utah, really. you got to get out that lane and go in the other lane. But we couldn't because it was packed. Yeah. What should we do? Stop and get hit? Yeah. And they pulled him over and they said, oh, this is just because we were like uh, just a couple miles away from where we we're going to my cousins. Mm -hmm. And they go, because you're visitors and you're, you're near where you're going, we'll just give you a warning. Mm. And they were rude too because they were female cops. Oh, God. I said, I don't want to go through these states and we get pulled over. Oh, they yeah, might hide us somewhere in a jail somewhere. Mm -mm. Everywhere got some different rules. Yeah. You want to have a meet and greet, Arafi? She's in California too. Oh, that would be nice. And then Kian is in, um, Kian, remind me again, Virginia or one of the Carolinas? Huh? You're gone? You guys got food? You guys got kid? <laughs> Esther, you got everything? <laughs> oh, oh, let, me, let, me, let me give her a Mabel's cake. You guys stop. You guys stop. The bear pantry it. takeover from the guy. Barbara stepped out. We have to hold it oh. down. Oh, no. <laughs> Barbara will be right back, folks. Oh, Keon's Virginia. from Virginia. Okay. Where where would we need to meet up? Chicago. I Tracy's think... in Chicago. What about Vegas? Vegas. Yes. <laughs> be that awesome. was it. Vegas. We all need to meet up in Vegas. Yeah. Everyone meet us in Vegas. That would be the plan. That would be really nice. That the trade shows and everything that happens, it would just make sense. Yes, yes, yes. yes. Barbara yeah. could bring her equipment. We all go live. Nobody be watching. We all be live. <laughs> yeah, that too. That too. I think that would be it. A story. Okay, well, let's see. What would be the next story that we need to tell? All right, here's a funny story from the last time we went to Belize. Okay, so... I seem to always have like misfortune when I go traveling, which is a good thing though, because it gives me the greatest stories. So I decided to go to Secret Beach in San Pedro, right? When I was in Belize, I decided rather than take the little golf cart that you can rent, that me, I'm from Belize, I'm an OG, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna ride to Secret Beach. I didn't realize Secret Beach was 14 miles away. Wow. Maybe less than that, 14 miles away from San Pedro town and riding on bumpy roads, not paved roads. So. I rode to Secret Beach, 14 miles, bumpy roads, fine, but then I forgot to keep hydrated. So riding back to San Pedro from Secret Beach, mm -hmm. my legs lock up, Jesus. and I'm pedaling the bike like this because uh -huh. they're so stiff. And I was like, okay, I need to stop and just let this pass. But then it's like 2 o'clock, and I have a snorkeling tour at 4 o'clock. Mm. So I still made it to my snorkeling tour I was like walking on the boat like this, stiff. Bye. 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 Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, Dane. I was walking 
to the snorkeling tour stiff like this. I tried to, I tried, I took Tylenol, I took water, I like tried to rehydrate myself. Like the snorkeling tour guys, like, are you sure you're okay to swim? I like Already. jumped in this water and I'm like snorkeling. <laughs> It was so fun. It was like the funniest experience. And I mean, if I would have missed out on the Belize coral reef, mm -hmm. what I saw there in San Pedro, I definitely would have been mad. It was like the greatest thing. Have you, have you been to Belize? I have not. I had a, a church outreach when I was a child. They all went okay. to Belize. So that's the closest chance I've ever had going. But I do want to go. Yeah. Is there a reason why they call it Secret Beach? Is there a story behind that? Yeah. So Secret Beach, I guess I don't, I forget how, like how new it is, but like, okay. So San Pedro, like you go past, I forget like um, the next town up. Mm -hmm. And then you're just taking like this like detour that goes like to the the um, west side of the island, mm -hmm. and you're just I don't know it's underdeveloped, so you're just going down this dirt road like windy wind. You'll see like a house here, like a stand there, and you finally get to the end, and it's like it's like a little shack, but like when you get out to the water, mm -hmm. it's like cabanas. It's mm -hmm. got like a little like party area, um, but I don't know. It's it's a nice it's nice. I bet it's beautiful. Uh, yeah. Gatorade time. Yeah, it definitely was Gatorade time. I needed Gatorade. I <laughs> yeah. needed I electrolytes. Was, man, that was scary. <laughs> that was scary. You I'll let Jermaine tell a story next. <laughs> uh let's see. What's a good story? What's a good story? Um, can nothing's coming to mind. <laughs> I'm on the spot. Uh let's see. I can tell my story about coming here. Um uh so I started watching Bear Pantry show probably in like 2018. Uh Facebook was doing like a featuring of mm -hmm. Barbara. And it kept showing up my timeline, and I would watch her recipes, and I kind of got attracted to the black cake, the Belizean black cake. Okay. Because I'm actually one of those weird people who likes fruit cake, like the regular American yeah. fruit cake. Like a lot of TV shows and stuff, they make a joke about how we hate fruit cake and people send them. Yeah. But I actually like fruit cake. <laughs> so once I saw the black fruit cake, I was interested, and I kind of reached out to Barbara, and I saw that she does Facebook, I mean um, YouTube, and does lives. I got in her lives. Um, just kept showing up in the lives with my family here, like Miss Lucky and Carla and everybody. And um, she made me, she called it a wrench, where you get like, uh, you can kick people off the group, people come in and try to troll us. And yeah. we just finally got closer and closer, traded phone numbers, kept talking. And, you know, she was like, you guys got to come visit. And I promised her I would. So I did come to California back in uh, November and I wasn't able to see her. So I promised I would make a trip specifically to come see Miss Barbara and that's what I did. So I got here Wednesday and oh my god, I've ate the best food ever. Um she's cooked pretty much every day. <laughs> um she asked me what one of some things I liked and she just went on from there. Um we recorded a couple shows together and I got to see the town of uh Fontana. So it's been really great, really great trip. I fly home tomorrow so praying for safe travels on yep. that. Safe travels. And, uh, we ended tonight well with an Easter, and we had a party, and had a few people over, and played card games. So it's been a good night. It's been a good night. Yeah, yeah. yeah Twenty Seventh Avenue is it is a definite takeover. I mean, this is just hijacking right now on a new level. <laughs> <laughs> what I'm gonna try? We're trying to keep the party going. Barbara's just wrapping up some stuff. You know, we had Easter dinner. Um, obviously, our family came over, showed her some love. Yes. Uh, just like you guys right now. Um, I've just floored to be even here on the show. I mean, Jermaine, yes. um, and just, you know, getting the love from you guys. Um, I think that this is going to be a great time for the Bear Pantry Show. Um, I'm excited, and I hope you guys are too. Spread the word. Um, I see Miss Lucky posting the links. Share, 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 like, keep sending. Let's make it grow a, a movement like, um, have you guys seen Swarm? This is like the new beehive. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Without the craziness. The Bear Pantry hive. Yes, for sure, for sure. Yes, give me elite membership status. I am a tier rank four. <laughs> I don't know if you guys play um, mobile games out there. I got gaffled oh, wow. by those mobile games that make you pay to play. And they like bumped me up to like a rank four and I paid way too much money. <laughs> this is Cora, you <laughs> don't guys. Don't get involved Cora in that. Say hello. <laughs> Can they see Cora? Cora, look at the camera. Oh, it was oh, so sweet. Jermaine was on almost every night. Barbara has some stories. Oh yeah, of course I'm the newcomer, so yeah, yes, I have to catch up. But you've been knowing Barbara for about five years as well, right? No, no, no not that long. Almost okay. uh, close to four. Um, uh, 2020, we got introduced, um, and then you know I did the website for her and did like some other things, um, you know, just to help her out. And obviously, she did some things to help me promote my site and my beach blankets I was selling at the time. Um, and we just, you know, we just had a good connection. Um, obviously the pandemic kept us from like, really like meeting face to face, like always something right. happened. Like 
if there was a COVID scare on her side, it's COVID scare on my side, which right. is like, we got to be safe. And now it's, what is COVID? What happened? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> my yeah. favorite Belize food, black dinner. Hands down, black dinner is my favorite, favorite Belize food. I cannot get enough of it. My aunt, the way she makes it. And actually, once Barbara makes black dinner, I'm sorry, auntie, but it's going to be Barbara. <laughs> 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 but black dinner is my favorite. Um, Joe's rice and beans are rice and beans ridiculous. Like they're so good. Oh, um, and I like the fish panadas. I'm not sure if that's Belizean or if that's yeah, it is. Thing, but that was yeah, that was is. amazing with the vinegar sauce. Oh my god, I had probably too many of those. Yeah, I, <laughs> panadas was my favorite thing um, growing up. Actually, to the fish one. And crazy thing is, and someone will like maybe disband me for saying this as a <laughs> Belizean, but I did not like beans and panadas or beans for the longest because yeah. we ate it every day growing Barbara up every well. day yeah. i got so like i came over here and it's like obviously we had that in belize but like you come over here in california you give a little kid a mcdonald's burger and then you're like okay you're gonna have that maybe once every two months and beans and rice for the rest i was so mad <laughs> i was like i want a burger yeah, yeah. <laughs> but i love my belize food now i can't get enough of it it's really good it's really good <laughs> I love Escabeche. Dean said, I have enough followers. I don't need no stalkers. Panadas, tamales, and constraters. And Jermaine had panadas, tamales, and salbutes the first day. And then Jenna made some tacos. Oh, And then the next day, what did we have? Bile up. Then the next day, we have the black soup. The black soup. Then today's rice and beans, chicken chicken. Oxtail, potato yes. salad, oh fried planting. Goodness. Oh my God, I don't think we, we missed anything, Jeremy. Um, it's lucky I do cook. You know, being from Louisiana, we eat a lot of our own kind of, you know, Southern Cajun type of things. So you name it, I can make it. He said he can make good gumbo. Mm -hmm. So yep. so you think you're going to come back this way again? Of course. Of course, of course. <laughs> he knows where yeah. family's at now, yeah. uh, Gary. <laughs> you know where you are. Yep. He's trying to make him hungry again. He just ate. Oh, man. <laughs> Yeah, I saw them to the door, and then my sister called, and I, I brought her to update really quickly about the book. Uh -huh. And she said, "Oh God, oh God!" <laughs> and so she can say, "Oh God." We're always <laughs> investigating. We go for it. Let's go get to the bottom of it. I, I feel it. Yeah. 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 We did. I tell you, we eat alligator. Huh? That somebody had sent me a gator last year for my birthday. Uh -huh. a, a content creator came to collab with me before, uh -huh. and one of Jada's friend cooked it on the barbecue grill, and we sat and ate it as a mukbang. The alligator. Oh, okay. It tastes like turkey. Okay. It tastes like turkey. It has a very um uh um poultry type taste to it. Mm, mm. Oh, you know what? I actually had it once, and I don't even know if it was really that. <laughs> mm -hmm. But I did try it um because I went to in New Orleans. I was in New Orleans once, uh -huh. mm -hmm. and then I tried it at like they just it was like like well somewhere it's like oh do you want to try it at the restaurant? Mm -hmm. I tasted it really quick. It was yeah, it was kind of like it was kind of mm -hmm. like turkey. Mm -hmm. It's kind of like turkey. Then the yeah. guy who gave it to me said it will taste kind of fishy, mm -hmm. but because they barbecued it, I didn't get the fishy taste from it. Yeah. I just got the turkey taste. Yeah. 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 He sent it for my birthday, and we did it like what a month or two later. <laughs> yeah, but Joe wouldn't touch it, but he eat give not. I said, you eat rat, but you don't eat alligator. <laughs> I he know. Said, huh? I said, I don't eat no lizard. He said, I don't eat no lizard. <laughs> oh, oh yes, Carla. We eat everything. Alligator, squirrel, <laughs> possum, coon, you name it. <laughs> it's hard for uh, any kind of critter in Louisiana. It's, it's, <laughs> it's a hard life it's for them. It's a hard life, yeah. <laughs> oh, my gosh. When I, when I when I remember when I was a kid, I saw them cook up. They, they cook the bocatora. Uh-huh. You know, they used to trick us. You yeah. see that you see that bocatora there, right? Uh-huh. And then all of a sudden, it's missing. And I said, we don't want no dinner today because it's not chicken. Eat it. That's all I tell. Eat it. What would that be closely related to? It's turtle. Uh, turtle. Oh, turtle. Oh, yeah, we have turtle soup. The, the bocator is it a sea turtle or a land turtle? No, I think I think they use a land turtle, but they say that they probably use a sea turtle, but mm -hmm. they're not supposed to. Okay. Yeah. So um the um the hikiti. Well, how is that different from Bocatura? I'm not They're sure. all turtles, mm. but the, and they one call one name is Hikiti and one name is Bocatura. Yeah, I've heard and those. Uh, yeah, Hikiti, yeah, those but... words are probably straight up out of Africa, from the, uh, the African ancestry. Uh -huh. Those words probably came from yeah. the, that, and we call lizard maklala. So those are those are not like Creole words. So they probably came from the and the African ancestry. Maybe cousin um, Jay could tell us. Do we still in here? B U B I? Did she talk? Of Jay. Yeah, she talked earlier. She talked? Okay. Hey, 27th Ave. Yes, love oh crawfish. It's crawfish season right now. It's about to end soon. Probably as soon as I get home, I'm going to get some crawfish. Uh huh. Yes. Yeah, he said, um, 
Did did Keon ever tell us where he was Tell when I was gone? Um, I think he said Virginia. Virginia, okay. Yeah. Okay. See, I have to remove part in that too. Their username, their real name, oh and where they're goodness. at. Curry, <laughs> crick, turtle <laughs> soup, lamb, Chinese snail. Okay, Miss Lucky. I have All right, snail. cousin, tell you here. I tell Joe, I'll tell you hi, you know. All right, you need to get your belt. No, he's over there like he was feeding the dogs and he was packing up food for Esther and them. Uh -huh. Yes. I had snail for the first time last year and it was i ate it and it was not bad i wouldn't eat it again but <laughs> it's just it's gritty yeah uh -huh. it's yeah. just real gritty and like it's just a weird snake? weird huh? have you ever had snake okay, yeah snake. i had uh -huh. snake you i like had it? snake you like yeah it? i was it wasn't bad i mean uh -huh. I, I put hot sauce <laughs> <laughs> I put Martinsville, hot Virginia. Virginia is a huge state. I had to drive through Virginia wow. one day, and I just wanted to die. It's it big like California. Forever. It's big like California. It felt like it. <laughs> Seeing you guys eat the alligator, Jada kept trying to get her dad. Yeah, he wouldn't eat it. Wouldn't eat it. I said, but you eat give not. <laughs> and he said, he said, but I don't eat guana. You know, and guana the lizard. Yeah, right? wish really. Ugh. One time we only went to Belize. Um, I oh eight when my aunt, my mom's aunt died. We went to four miles to that museum that they have now by where the beach was. Uh -huh. And as we got out the car, the little wish Willie was running, right? And me and Jada jumped on the hood of the car and we had a Komodo dragon, Komodo dragon. <laughs> my friend started to die and he goes, that's a damn Komodo dragon. <laughs> oh my goodness, man. That, I seen one of those things too. Like they, there was like this place because I was, the same thing I was telling about this story in um, San Pedro. Uh -huh. They had this part where they, they said there used to be some old Mayan ruins and there's like a boardwalk that goes through like this little like marsh right uh -huh. but it's abandoned and so i didn't know that I, I just it's on the map so i'm like walking through it thinking i'm gonna get to the end where there's someone there all of a sudden there's like three or four of those things just boom, 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 boom. <laughs> run past me i just ran back i said no it's too much i'm gone <laughs> carla she said you never eat black pudding either what's black pudding is, is that, that liver the, with the blood i think is it with blood is that the? i'm not sure what's black pudding they make with some type of blood Black yeah, pudding. we have a sausage in Louisiana that they make with blood. It's called black something. I could be wrong. No about. iguana. She said, me never eat cre creketa. No way. No turtle, no agouti, and no iguana. That's probably some kind of Trini or Guyanese stuff. Yeah. You can't outrun a Komodo dragon? Well, you couldn't <laughs> tell us that was no damn Komodo dragon. I just saw it biting my toe, my toe falling off. Like what happened to that one actress's husband years ago? Hikati is a river turtle. Loggerhead turtle, way gone. Um, I believe it's from the sea. Not sure about Bocatora. Okay, that's yeah. Cousin Jay. Black pudding is blood sausage. Yeah, and it's delicious. Okay. Yeah, yeah it's, uh, Germans eat a lot of blood sausage as well. <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. I've had it. It's not bad. Germans said nothing is safe. That's not like down there in Australia. <laughs> nothing uh, safe down there either. When the world ends, it's going to be Cajun people still thriving. <laughs> We're not going to know. We're not going to know. It, 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 it. <laughs> <laughs> you eat everything. Yeah. <laughs> wow, sausage. Wow. The chat is blowing up. <laughs> uh -huh. See, these people are knowledgeable. They teach they us are. a lot. They are. Yeah. yeah. And and don't let me get in a name and tell them go investigate because we are gonna find down to the ancestors, <laughs> five generations up. We will find their mama, their yeah. baby daddy. <laughs> <laughs> Miss Lucky, she always working. Thank you, Miss Lucky, for sharing about the Patreon. I have to start putting videos again. Longanisa. What? what is that, Myrna? Longanisa. Sounds like a pasta. I know. That's what I'm thinking. Like some a kind of crazy form meat. of lobster. Boom. Haggis. Is that is is that what haggis is? The blood sausage in the mm. for Irish? Or no, that's a pig, that's a sheep intestines, and it's like wrapped with like Stuff that's oh, blood sausage. Mm, yeah, okay. so that's what it is. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Cool. What of Christine course. said, this Irish also well, eat that's blood my sausage. Dad. Okay. Yeah, yeah. I can't wait for you to do the ancestry DNA. Yeah. And see who you'll come up related to. Oh, I know, nice. I know. That's gonna be crazy. That'd be nice. You should do a show if you could. Mm-hmm. Uh, Gary's gonna have to come back several oh, times. He's he done started oh, a sorry, problem. You too. You already started a problem. <laughs> <laughs> I'll definitely be back. Yeah. Yeah, and if you're coming through, um, Jermaine, and you're like with other people, San Diego, LA, and you only could give me two hours, I'll take the two okay. hours. Okay. Cousin Jay came and gave me four hours, and I took the four hours. <laughs> Someone said the same thing. 
yeah, you know what? We found out that Gary's grandma is Joe's godmother, and those people are related to one of Joe's brothers. Same, yeah. same mom, different dad. So Gary's not really related to Joe yet that we know, but he's doing his ancestry. So um, keep looking, uh, Cousin Jay, because she's the one that traces all the heritage for us once the name pop in there. Uh -huh. And she'll come and say, oh, look, see this come on this one tree and let's trace to see how they're related to us and so on and so on. So I'm mm -hmm. sure it'll pop in there because he looks like my younger brother Rory mixed with my cousin Troy. Okay. And cousin Troy is from my mom's side of the family. Okay, okay. Mm -hmm. When, when Joe first went to the, Joe stood right at the door, make you ring the doorbell. Uh -huh. and he goes, oh my God, who's he going? Oh my God. Because <laughs> <laughs> uh, Jay wasn't put on the show. <laughs> you, look, you see how she said? Um, Jermaine, she didn't want to be on the show because she said people don't know her and stalk her. So she, I taped her and put her on Patreon. Does Cousin Jay live far? She lives in Belize. Oh, lives in she Belize. lives in um, okay. uh, Key Cocker in Belize. But gotcha. she comes to Northern California. Well, we got to come see you next time, Cousin Jay. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah, she said, I don't want it. That, why do you think she um go as beauty? She don't want to know who she is because she's popular. <laughs> <laughs> While you were gone, me and Gary are planning your meet and greet in Vegas. Just let you know. What? We're planning your meet and greet. <laughs> we're going to Vegas? <laughs> yeah, we're all going to uh, Vegas. Yes. Would you guys come for real? Yeah, sign, sell, yeah. and deliver. Okay. I'll put it together. Okay. We can put Carla it together. say what happens in Vegas stays in Vegas. I know you won't be. come because oh, like, you, you have another home there. there. I would definitely. And Mungo will come because he lives there. Yep. <laughs> oh man, that'd be nice. It would be nice. You could set up mm -hmm. a little studio. Yeah. <laughs> you could just rent out like an Airbnb. Yeah. That'd yeah. Be nice. And then just have Jada to... ran a nice Airbnb when they had Jory's wedding. Yeah. Yeah. We could oh, do yeah. That. You told me. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It was a cool place. <laughs> yeah, 27. 27 up. He's in Miami. He gonna come. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Everybody should have a flight. Hi, Mike. Today. How you doing? Happy Easter. Yes. <laughs> All right, make I move so um cousin Jake will see Joe. Hold on, hold on. Yeah. No, sit down, sit down. We're almost done. Come, come, baby. Well, I'm good. You guys stay there. You, you guys are good. Don't move. Don't okay. move. Sit, sit, no, Gary. Sit. All right. Sit, Gary. <laughs> don't move. He just he always come and say a quick hello, hello. people. How you guys doing? <laughs> he, have, he, has, he, has, he has his favorites, you know, that like him. Yeah. Come on. <laughs> We're taping some song a little while ago. Oh God. Uh -oh. There's too much noise. How you gonna tape song in all this noise? Yeah. We need to have Joe sing. Cousin Jay, see your ballet? You, you never said a thing where she like here. Yeah. The the um salutation to your channel. Hello, people. Hello <laughs> here. <laughs> <laughs> and Gary's gonna make him a logo and make him his own website yeah. to sell all the stuff that he makes. Gary's yeah. like Joe should be making money. Yeah, yeah. Joe Let's should look, be. Say hi, country Joe. Jasmine yeah. say hi, Joe. Say hi, Joe. Twenty seven. Everybody saying hi. <laughs> Keon saying hi, Joe. Yeah, I was, I was taping a song. <laughs> oh, George is gone. You want to hear my song? 27 Ab, no one hear that. Yeah. 27 Ab, which is your favorite Joe song? Yes, we will hear Oh, he did. Oh, he did. Because <laughs> just say hello, handsome. It's all I can do tonight. <laughs> Twenty-seven. Who's that angel? He likes who's that angel. <laughs> See, they know his songs too, Gary. Georgie. They know his songs. This is one of my originals. Afford to buy the damn Tennessee whiskey. <laughs> That's the one that he wants to make the lamp out of, Gary. They need to hear that fullness of it. I like. They they hear it. You gonna sing for them? Yeah. Uh huh. Oh shit. <laughs> oh my god, man, that's too much country for she. I don't even listen to country, and I would listen to Joe's CD. Awesome. I would listen awesome. to Joe's CD. Awesome. 
I got like uh, five songs put together right here. I'll make it. You're going out at the beach? Yeah. I'm he said you're going to knock that next man off his thing, James Brown, remember? That'll be good. <laughs> That'll be good. Let's do was it. giving us a whole performance yesterday, man. Uh -huh. Yeah, Joe makes good. country cool for sure. Mm -hmm. Joe <laughs> makes country cool for sure. I you make up like all it. these songs about George Jones. Who's that angel? Yeah, you have to do you, um, get who's that angel together and have to come do that for 27 hours. Okay, okay. <laughs> who's I, that I, angel, I'm... Gary, is about some girl that um I, I don't think it's real, right? No. It's not a true story. It's, it's just he, he wrote it that when the girl was in high school, the girl liked him, but he didn't like the girl because the girl was ugly. No, it's not, no, no, it's not my like ugly, but you know how you know how it was cool. The girl wasn't cool. Yeah, you know, she was fat and all that kind of, and she liked this cute guy, but this oh, he was overweight, not ugly, right. overweight. And you know, you know, you don't even look at her. Oh, but later on, she lose weight and she was worked a vixen. She worked hard and she was a knockout. <laughs> Who's that angel? And the girl said, Hannah, with me. <laughs> yeah, that's funny. He makes up his own little stories. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> the dogs well, that... eat, right? Yeah. The dogs are okay. We were awful with the dogs today. They eat till like 8 o'clock and they normally eat at 5. Four probably cost us all. Yeah. <laughs> I got one name. Picking up the pieces. Mm. You know when it break your heart? If that, you, that's you like, like if from Ernie Smith Ben Dong. If you uh, hang around, <laughs> if you hang around and pick up the pieces, you yeah. get the whole heart. So you know, <laughs> <can't break>. Yeah. <laughs> oh, Kendrick Mac Coleman. Hello uh, from Belize. Ken oh, Kendrick is the one always making cookies. Oh. Every time can we come on? Let me get rid of this. There's no virus threat. Anybody touch anything here? Bye bye, people. All right, baby. Thank you for saying hi because yeah. I don't want cousin Jay to take off my head. <laughs> yeah, Kenrick is down there in the southern part of the district. And every time he come on, he making um oatmeal raisin cookies. <laughs> wow. Kendrick, I saw that a Belizean won the cross country race, man. I was so excited yesterday. Oh, yeah, yeah. I told you my dad went to the Olympics for cycling, right? For Belize? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that was that was crazy. I was couldn't believe it. You're drinking hot tea tonight? Okay. <laughs> cool. Tell Joe make a song about his sugar. Okay, Miss Lucky, I'll tell him. <laughs> <laughs> then I'll know Joe and his songs, man. Joe get up at 5 30 6 o'clock in the morning and he's singing full force and playing the guitar we come <laughs> off we head with the pillow please god we want to sleep please That's please funny. Mm -hmm. <sighs> today he was up doing his music that's real country mm -hmm. then <laughs> not was, early i couldn't complain because he was cooking mm -hmm. the chicken and the oxtail he was cooking so let me shut my mouth i smell the thing cooking right <laughs> okay so okay guys it's what time right it's after 12 for them people, you know. Yeah. And I'm up in here. All right, guys. We're going to go ahead and wrap this one up. And um, you're going to see Gary again more often. You're going to see Jermaine come back again. Yep. And um, he not going to say when because you're not going to stalk him. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be in the comments very soon. <laughs> yeah. And Jada didn't even come sing for you guys today. Jada run off with Dina again. I'm like, Dina, aren't you tired of Jada? <laughs> She was there for like two days at the orchard. They, really? they have an orange, the granny own an orange okay. orchard. It's beautiful, five acres. Nicely, um, the trees are all set out. It's not bush and, you know, it's you can drive through it with a golf cart and stuff like that. Okay. 10, 14 in Belize. Okay, cool. Oh, Keon, oh, wow. it's so You've good. You've never had oxtail? I thought I got oxtail in Virginia, Keon. Oh. Hmm. Did I say his name right, Keon? Yeah. Okay. A Marvelous Wolf is Keon. Gotcha. Uh -huh. Oh, Keon been with me. Shh. Before mommy died. Oh wow! That's yeah, good. some people been here forever, man. Yeah. After eleven, there too. Right. Yeah. Five After lucky. eleven, where you are, Tracy? All right. Tell tell you um tell your other half we say hello. All right. Yes. Yeah, bye. All right, guys. Thank you for bye, coming to the show, Jermaine and Gary. Some love, yes. and we're gonna keep you up to date as to what's going on with the book. And if you guys need to, if we need your help to do anything, to report it, to do whatever we need. We'll let you guys know, right? Meanwhile, thank you for buying the new book, the bread book. And thank you for the reviews and the five stars, even for the person who just gave the five stars, but not a review. If you're a part <laughs> of the team, I appreciate it still. The stars matter. Yeah. You know, the stars really matter. But I, I'd like if you could put both of them together and press your way because Christina, Miss Lucky, pressed their way until they approved it. 
So I was like, thank God. All right. Kenrick the ball up was really good. And Keon, Jamaican men do good with Oxtail. They have good Oxtail. Mm hmm. Nice, nice. I, all I can say is I'm floored. I'm just so glad to be here. Thank you so much, Barbara, for having me here. Oh, thank you for coming. And I will be... We've only been inviting you since the pandemic started. I know, I know. And you know you know the story behind that. We won't get into that one, yeah. but, but well, maybe later well, on. Well, I'll you couldn't come because it was shut down. Yeah. Yeah, and then we open like I think 2022 was like your first opportunity yeah. to come. Yeah, we can't, we can't hold it against you. Yeah. All right, guys. All thank right. you for coming in. And uh, we'll see you in the next one. And the next video I'm going to upload is going to be Jermaine making the bread with me. Cool? Yes. Bye. All right. Bye. If you like what you saw here today, guys, consider watching one of my other videos right here.